one of the NFL's top receivers over the past several years has decided to call it quits. After being cut by the Raiders earlier this month, Jordy Nelson, the wideout who dominated alongside Aaron Rodgers for many campaigns, has announced his retirement from the NFL. However, as Jason Witten's return to professional football this year shows, any player still capable of keeping up on the field can be coaxed back to football, and with the Patriots needing a veteran receiver to fill the hole in the offense that Rob Grankowski leaves behind, New England should still pursue the now-retired wide receiver, highest passer rating among QB pass catcher tandems over the last five seasons, Min. 300 targets, Aaron Rodgers. While not incredible statistics, this production could still be useful for a Patriots roster that is looking increasingly depleted. It may not be an easy sell to get Nelson to return to NFL football, but the opportunity to join one of the greatest quarterbacks of all time and a potential Super Bowl contender could very well help New England convince Nelson to sign on for one last year in the league, suggested the not sure why, 739 receiving yards last year, 100.9 rating when targeted, can play outside or in the slot. Starting caliber WR that played well in the last month of the season a year ago, Evan Lazar, at Easy Lazar, March 15, 2019 The Patriots have lost a lot of pieces this offseason, from Trey Flowers and Malcolm Brown, to Grankowski on the offensive side of the ball. If they hope to remain a Super Bowl contender in 2019, New England will need to add a lot of depth and skill, and although Nelson has announced his retirement, there's no harm in trying to bring the receiver back with an offer he can't refuse.